And we're here at the Van Gelder studio, this incredible studio in Englewood Cliffs, New Jersey. Rudy found this property that was just property. This is all built from the ground up. His conception of what the studio would be. A lot of people think of this studio as being Blue Note, Blue Note, Blue Note, but it was also at the same time Prestige, and it was near the end of the Savoy label, Verve, and it went on to Impulse and ABC. This is like a shrine. People want to come just to see this place. My name is Maureen Sickler. I was Rudy Van Gelder's assistant. When he died, he left the studio to me. I'm the engineer here now. I'm trying to take what he did and keep the studio going. A lot of musicians come here for the first time, and it's up to them to make the next historical thing. Welcome all of you to the Van Gelder studio. As you can hear, but this is a pretty incredible sound. There's a reason that the history is so great here. It's because it's such a great acoustic environment. This piano, this was the piano that started with, you know, Bud Powell, all of Bud Powell Monk. There's the, the room back then with Dizzy. And what's very distinctive about this place is the walls. You, you could always recognize Rudy's place because there's no walls like this. That's a Bill Evans with full symphony orchestra record. It's like going into the great houses of worship around the world. Absolutely. Yeah. For a jazz musician. This, this is, is what that is. Our yeah. language was born here, right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's such a beautiful place to be. If you look around, this is almost like a, like a grand spaceship to another realm. It's like a porthole that affords us the opportunity to be able to transcend the notes that are on the page and get to the feeling that is eternal. But we also share a common bond as we all fall under the Consome group, Steinway, Ludwig. The soundtrack of our lives is Bach trumpets. And not only do we have the opportunity to be brought together by the music, but by the folks that create the instruments that we play. And that's a beautiful thing, all coming full circle here.
Hank Mobley recorded an album called Reach Out, featuring Up, Over, and Out. And it was recorded here at Van Gelder's. It's hard to play his music without having a smile on your face, and this is one of those kind of pieces that does that. I'm a huge Hank Mobley fan right now. I'm listening to Hank Mobley a lot. I got that record maybe 20, 25 years ago. I wore that record out, and now I want to go home and listen to the record again. I think it's fantastic that we have the opportunity to pay tribute to that composition and that recording in, in such a way that we're able to feature Summer Camargo at the, uh, the beginnings of what is going to be, and I know it's going to be, an amazing career. I remember the first time I heard you, and I said, who the heck is that? She's going to be something. <laughs> Little did I know that later on we were going to be playing the same instruments together. So it's like full circle. I'm really thankful that in high school I was able to participate in NYO Jazz and Sean Jones is the one who runs it and that was such an amazing experience to travel the world with one of the best trumpet players alive but it's also a huge honor to be here to be with some of you know people that I've looked up to for a really long time. The deepest connection is you and I, Jalil, what was it, uh, 2001 I think we met. It was literally maybe two or three months after 9-11. That's how long ago that was. And now we're all, all here together again, not just getting past 9-11, but COVID, and we're still here, and it, it's a beautiful thing. This band has never played together before. There were no rehearsals. What was evident from the second that we all walked in the room and we walked into this kind of like hallowed space, this cathedral to jazz, so to speak, is how much we love this music. And because of that, it, it creates a special bond camaraderie between us. As the drummer here, I'm, I'm kind of spoiled because I get to be you know, a part of cymbal families and drumstick families and drumhead families and all sorts of families. You know, being a part of the Ludwig family now, it's, it's really unique that I, I get to you know, be in a new family with uh, other instrumentalists. It's great to get in the trenches here at uh, Van Gelder Studios and play and feel this music and play our instruments that connect us as well. So it's, it's really a, an amazing feeling. We share the love and the passion uh, for the music, and we have such reverence and, and gratitude for, for this space that we're in and, and, and the studio. Um, and you, you felt that on, on every take and every second of, of playing together, and you you've felt the love between us, we felt, you felt the love of the music, and you felt the love for the craftsmanship of these instruments. Thank you, Con Selmer for bringing us together. Thank you, Ludwig, for bringing us together.